Hello YouTube. As you see, I have another moth in here. And this time, it is a male. Let me get in closer for you guys. This is the wi a wild male that was attracted last night to the female's pheromones. Uh, as you can see, he is very big antenna. And that is to find the female's pheromones and head to them. And she's right here looking beautiful as usual. Oof, I don't want him to fly off. So I have to be a little careful here. Looks like he was attacked by a bird. So, yeah, he's not the best looking moth because of that. But yet, you can see the color differences. He has a lot brighter colors. Well, they're about even. No, stay still. I'm about even. He has a little bit darker ones and smaller eyes up here. And she has a lot bigger ones. There's just a couple minor differences between them. I'm probably going to get a plant for them so they could lay their eggs on it. And... And yeah. That is all. Looks like she laid some infertile, an infertile egg right here. Oh, you can see all these on the bottom. These are all infertile eggs. But soon they're going to be fertile and everyone's going to be happy. And I did have another moth in here though that I wanted to show you guys. I don't know where she went. She's a tiger moth, one of those woolly bears. Oh, she's right here. Here she is. I've been trying to get a male for her too. She's very pretty. You can see the bright red underwings. Move out of the way, man. Come on. I know you. So yeah, I have a bunch of moths in here. And then this is the chrysalis she hatched from, or pupa. And this is the pupa this one hatched from. So yeah, remember to like and subscribe and keep checking for updates. And I'll be doing some other caterpillar updates. I have a bunch of cool caterpillars for you guys to see.